Hey folks, how's it going? This is Iron Seagull here, back with another Sims Info and Thoughts video. So, we got a sneak peek at the next round of voting for the second Community Stuff Pack, which is going to be focused on knitting. So the next round is going to be on Create a Sim, and SimGuru Sarah gave us a sneak peek on the forums. She says, Howdy Simmers, our next round of voting will kick off on Monday, January 27th, at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. You'll be voting for the Create a Sim clothing that will be featured in our Arts and Crafts Stuff Pack, with an emphasis on knitted attire. Your vote will feature knitted items as well as crafty clothing with DIY accents. Our art team is hard at work finalizing the concept you'll see in the survey, but we wanted to give you a sneak peek before the weekend. Check out the fabulous hats that could be included in this stuff pack, but only if you vote for them. What age groups would you like to see wearing these hats? Share your feedback in the comments below. Have a great weekend and happy simming! One thing that SimGuru Ninja mentioned on Twitter is that we're going to get 15 votes to assign across 90 plus choices in total. Excuse me, what? I'm sorry. That's messed up. <laughs> I hope 15 is just the number of stuff that we can vote on and is not the final number of items that will actually make it into the final product. Because even for a stuff pack, that seems like a really low number of Create a Sim items. I was really hoping that this stuff pack could lean a little bit more on Create a Sim than Build Buy, but I guess that might not be the case. But here is a better look at all the hats that we can vote on. I already like most of these, so I think once we see all of the items, it's going to be a real struggle to pick out just 15. But if I were to narrow down my top five, I would say, yeah, this is basically another top five. <laughs> top five best hats for the knitting stuff pack would be 20. 20 has to make it. Like, I'll be so disappointed if that doesn't make it in. Just a llama hat. <laughs> it's too cute. It looks like it would work really well as a hat for kids. I also like number 10 a lot. It looks very snug and warm and it's not quite like anything we have in the game yet in terms of cold weather wear, so I would love to see that one in. 18, I've seen a lot of discussion about already on Twitter, and I'll probably vote for that one too, because I do want to try and have a balance of items I'm sure I'll use quite a bit, and then also a few items here and there that are a bit odd but visually stand out and even though I won't use them as much, they will really make the sims that I put them on stand out amongst the many sims that I've made. The other two I like are number four and number six. Number six is one that I think kind of makes sense with this knitting stuff pack. I can imagine that being knitted. But also, I want at least one item that isn't something that looks like it would just be <laughs> worn in the winter because it looks like pretty much all my favorites would go well with seasons. So I want something that makes sense for the warmer months. And number four makes a lot of sense to me. Also, it kind of fits the direction I wanted the stuff pack to go in, which was Granny Chic. But in the end, 10 and 20 are basically my non-negotiable picks. Those are the ones that I must have in my game. So overall, I am looking forward to the cast vote, but also slightly dreading it because I feel like it's going to be a painful process to narrow down my favorites to only 15 out of over 90. But I guess that's the point. The Sim Gurus can't just use every single idea that they come up with for a pack because they only have so many resources, and it's pretty typical of game development, not just for The Sims, where a lot of stuff does have to be left on the cutting room floor. So that's it, that's just how it goes. And that wraps up another Sims Info and Thoughts video. So feel free to let me know in the comment section below which are your favorite hats out of these ones that we saw. And be sure to subscribe if you want to keep up with my latest content from The Sims, Sock the Hedgehog, and more. So I will talk to you all later, and have a great day. Thanks for watching.